Brian, that truck was actually reported stolen 13 years ago, and the keys are still in the ignition. Today, Lake Hickory divers took me out on the water to show me where they found it and how deep it submerged. They say something smells fishy. Lake Hickory scuba divers are swimming down dark waters. We're treasure hunters. On Sunday, they got word a truck might be at the bottom of the lake. Brian Stafford showed us how sonar radar picked up the hunk of metal now marked by orange buoys. You see it there and there. He plunged 25 feet deep with a flashlight as his only source of light. From a GoPro camera, you can see the steering wheel of the Nissan Titan truck. The keys still in the ignition. Around back, the North Carolina license plates read PWJ 9466. From my training and experience, I would definitely say it was purposely put there for whatever reason. Stafford says it looks suspicious. He believes the silver or tan truck rolled down a path across the lake. I've had a career in law enforcement as well, so finding stolen items is nothing new to me. Hickory police ran the plates and discovered the car was reported stolen in 2006, sitting underwater for the last 13 years. Being able to find them when you're just out diving and enjoying your day on the lake, is it's always a surprise and a shock to us when we do. And right now, divers are waiting for the green light from Hickory Police to pull the truck out of the water. They say they've already pulled two cars out of the water this year. And we are also waiting to learn more to see who owns the truck and how it ended up at the bottom of the lake. I'm live in Hickory tonight, Lauren Dugan, Fox 46 Charlotte. Guys, we really appreciate you watching our videos. If you liked it, make sure to give us a big thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, simply hit that subscriber button for us and make sure you hit the little bell to turn on all notifications. If you want to see some other cool videos, make sure to click these links here. They could be scuba tips, they could be diving videos, search and recovery videos, or gear reviews. Once again, guys, we really appreciate it.